Is everybody ready for math? I am. Good. Well, I'll tell you what, why don't we start? Why don't we start with um, you counting, get everybody counting, and then you can ask the questions, okay? All right. Everybody ready to count? Okay, that means everybody stand up. All you, all you boys, stand up. Come on, guys. All right, everybody standing up? Everybody counting with me. Now, before we start, let's see who's smart today. Um, who can tell me what are even numbers? What are the even numbers? Hmm, 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 hmm. What are the even numbers? Let's see. Evan, you know what the even numbers are? Well, I didn't hear you, but here they are in case you, somebody else doesn't know. Even numbers are 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, right? Okay. Who can tell me the odd numbers? Roberto? 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. That's right. Okay. Let's get counting. Everybody put your brains on. Okay, here we go. One, three, five, seven, nine. One, three, five, seven, nine. One, three, five, seven, nine. Okay, ready? Okay. <sighs> One, three, five, seven, nine. Eleven, thirteen, fifteen. 17, 19, 21, 23, 25, 27, 29, 31, 33, 35, 37, 39, 41, 43, 45, 47, 49, 51, 53, 55, 57, 59, 61, 63, 65, 67, 69, 71, 73, 75, 77, 79, 81, 83, 85, 87, 89, 91, 93, 95, 97, 99, and 100, and whoa. Good job. Okay, here we go. Hmm. Let's start with, let's start with Darielle. Darielle, how many days in a week? Easy sneezy, huh? Seven, okay. Alexandra, how many months in a year? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 12, good, 12 months in the year. Evan, no, you already got a question. Samuel, Samuel, how many hours in a day? You remember? <laughs> Think of the clock. Think of the clock. What, how many numbers on the clock? Okay, 24 hours in a day. Angelique. Angeli, how many minutes? How many minutes in an hour? Mm. We have 60, right? 60 minutes in an hour. And one minute is how long you get for your victory drill on Fridays. And one minute is how long you get for your speed drill in math. That's one minute. And there are 60 of those in one hour. Okay, Avi. Avi, how many seconds in a minute? Remember, seconds. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, Avi, how many seconds in a minute? 
60, just like 60 seconds in, I mean, 60 minutes in an hour, right, 60. Okay, Alessandro, how many toes on a foot? Five toes, good. So you have 10 toes, right? I only have eight. One day, I might show you. I only have four. Just like my hand only has four fingers. I have four fingers and on each hand and four toes. <laughs> okay, anyway. So, Alessandro, you have five toes in a foot. But how many inches are in a foot? How many inches are in a foot, Alessandro? Think of your ruler. Ruler, 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 ruler. Ruler is one foot. Twelve, right? Twelve. And how big is an inch? Um, Daniela, show me. How big is an inch? Okay, Miss Susan, can you show the kids how big is an inch? Shh, sure. Okay, remember your thumb. From here to here on your thumb, right? That's an inch, and there's 12 of them in a foot. And a foot is the size of your daddy's foot, right? Okay, your turn again. Okay. Hmm. Well, I think... That's everything we have so far. I don't see anything else on the list, Miss Susan. Okay, you did a good job. Okay, you want to sit down, Peppy? Because today's lesson is very, very easy. Boom, it's going to be fast. So we're going to go over some other things, okay? All right. Okay, now, we talked about, we talked about things being in half, half of something, right? Let me get a piece of paper. Don't run away, I'll be right back. Piece of paper. Okay, piece of paper, right? If we fold it, so both sides are the same, we have a half, one half here and one half here, right? Okay. Now we have the same thing on our clock. Did you know that? Now sometimes, People here, when I was a little girl, um, they used to say half past the hour. People don't say that so much, but I have heard people say that here. Now, if we take our, we can take our clock. We can take our clock and we can divide our clock in half. Right? We can divide our clock in half. So, remember, a clock... An hour has 60 minutes, right? Hour has 60 minutes. So if we divide it in half, one, two, three, four, five, six, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six and six make 12, don't they? We know that. Okay. So in our work, we are going to count on our minutes by fives. So we say five, ten, 15, 20, 25, 30. Half an hour has 30 minutes, okay? Now, hmm, let's do this. Let's talk about half of numbers, okay? So if we take, if we take a number, let's say the number 6. Is 6 an odd number or an even number? We know it's an even number, right? Because our numbers go 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, right? We know that. You know that. Okay, so these are all even numbers. So we can divide them in half, can't we? Right? So if we divide 2 in half, what two numbers make, what two numbers make two? One and one make two, don't they? How about the number six? What two numbers make six? Who knows? 
Mm, 12. It's 12. 6 and 6 make 12. How about 8? Who knows? What two numbers make 8? What two numbers make 8? 4 and 4. What two numbers make 7? Mm. Oh, I did it again. <laughs> Boom, 14. I keep... I'm looking at the number and telling you the answer. 14 is 7 and 7, right? How about... 10. What two numbers make 10? 5 and 5. What two numbers make 12? What two numbers make 12? 24, don't they? Well, let's look at our clock. Let's do the other way, okay? What's 1 plus 1 is 2, right? 1 plus 1 is 2, so half of 2 is 1. What's 2 plus 2? Um, Liesel, what's 2 plus 2? 4, good. So half of 4 is 2. What's 3 plus 3? Hazard, 3 plus 3 is 6. That's right, so half of 6 is 3. What's 4 plus 4? Steffi, Steffi, what's 4 plus 4? Is 8. So if 4 plus 4 is 8, what is half of 8? Four, okay? Five plus five is 10. So half of 10 is five. Six plus six is what? 12, right? Six plus six is 12. So half of 12 is six. What's seven plus seven? Seven plus seven, let's see, Daniela. So seven plus seven is? 14. So half of 14 is 7. Do you know 8 plus 8? See, these are all things we were supposed to learn in kindergarten. Some of you know them and some of you don't. 8 plus 8 is 16. So half of 16 is 8. We have 8. What's half of 8? 4. 4 and 4 makes 8, right? Okay, what's 9 plus 9 is... Who knows, who knows, who knows? Joshua. Joshua, what's 9 plus 9? 18. Okay, so half of 18, Joshua, is what? What's half of 18? 9. Who can tell me what 10 plus 10 is? Two tens. What's two tens? 20, right? Okay, so 10 and 10 is 20. Half of 20 is 10. How about 11 and 11? Does anybody know what 11 plus 11 is? 22. Half of 22 is 11. And the last one is 12 plus 12. What's 12 plus 12? How many hours in a day? 24. So half of 24 is 12. Okay, we're going to start working on that one. Okay, on our homework paper today, this is the one we have. It's going to take you five minutes to do your homework, not even that. Okay, on this side of your page, you're going to do the picture, and it's an easy picture, like kinder picture. Um, and just count by twos, do, 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 all the way around the picture. You do not have to color it. If you don't want to, you don't have to color it. Okay, this side of the picture um, tells about the months of the year. But this is for the north in the United States where we have seasons. In Honduras, you don't. Honduras, you have the rainy season and the dry season. And so it's not like that. But in the United States, if you look, and the first month of the year is January. And in January, we have snow, and snow is kind of like ice cream. It doesn't taste like ice cream, but it's kind of, it's not smooth like ice cream, but it's kind of like ice cream. Okay, that's the first one. It is, there's snow. The second, okay, we're just going to go first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth, that's all this is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And everybody can count to twelve. Good. Okay, the second ND, that's second. The second month of the year is February. February is cold and sometimes there is snow also. March is when it starts getting warm and that's Semana Santa. Sometimes is in March, sometimes in April, okay? And that's when it, it rains a lot in March. Um, it's starting to warm up and it gets windy. Um, and the, the flowers start to come up. April, we have lots of rain, kind of like we have rain here. April has lots of rain, but here April is starting to get dry, right? 
Um, we have lots of rain. It's, everything grows. It's very pretty. Lots of flowers. The trees have flowers on them, a lot of them. Um, and people, the bushes have flowers. It's very pretty in the spring. Um, flowers. May. May has a lot of flowers. June. June is when it starts getting hot. Okay, summertime, and we don't get much rain. July. July is very hot, and your kids are out of school, and that's just when they're fun time. Families take trips. August, really hot. Kind of like August here is hot. Mm -hmm. September, it starts cooling down. In September, the leaves fall off of the trees. Okay? And it's, it's cooling down. It's very pretty. The leaves in September turn yellow and red and, very, and orange. It's very, very pretty. And then they fall off the trees. Um, October leaves, they start in September. November is cool. Um, and we s sometimes get a little bit of snow, but not a lot, okay? Depending on where you live, okay? November is cool, cold, really, in some places cold. And December is cold, cold, and we get snow, okay? That's all this is. You don't have to color it. So, first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth, thirteenth. Okay? That's all that is. Easy, <coughs> easy lesson for today. Won't take you any time at all to do it. Okay, see you later. Don't forget your cards, though.